Well done, mate. That's back to back away wins. Happy with that one? Yeah, it was, uh, wasn't the best game of football to watch, um, but the lads dug in second half, especially gritty performance. I don't think we give, I don't, I don't remember Paul having a chance really second half, and we, we just really controlled the game, kept our shape really well, and just took our chances when, when it came. Um, I thought the first half, I thought the first 15 minutes, we started really, really brightly. I thought we could have possibly uh, taken the opportunities a little bit better. Um, but then after that, I thought you know, it was a, a gritty game without too many chances in the game. Yeah, the wind obviously made a bit of a difference and it was difficult. I mean, Port Malag, even though they didn't have many shots, they were up the pitch quite a lot. Would you say it was an even game? Yeah, I don't think there was much in the game, to be honest. Um, we probably had maybe the better chances first off. I think maybe they should have scored there. Their one chance they had really the volley in the six yard box one time we've switched off. Uh, but yeah, I'd probably say it's a pretty even contest, a little bit of quality we've got with Danny. Uh it's probably got us to three points. Yeah. What what do you make of the red cards as well? Did you see it? From my angle, obviously both players came together. Um a bit of a disagreement between the players. Yeah, I think it's a difficult one to comment on. Um I've watched it right away from from the start when they first come together and, and uh I, I don't think Hadji's was a, was a red. Um, but the other lads got up and, and sort of pushed him in the face. I don't think he meant to push him in the face when he slipped. So, um, all I'll comment on is, is Hadji's. I don't, I'm 100% sure it wasn't a red. But, um, you know, we've just got to accept decisions. It's a difficult, difficult task on the pitch. I suppose they can only get, see what they've, uh, what they've seen and give that decision. Yeah, and it's got to the point now, Mulder pulling further away from those bottom places, that relegation zone. And at the same time, not too far away from the top half of the table. You know, halfway through the season, perhaps a little bit further on, what are the ambitions now? Same as the start, make sure we're safe in the league. Um, until it's mathematically um, that we can't, you know, can't get dragged into those relegation places, the, the first task is for almost is to stay in the league. Um, we've still got to stay focused on that. We can't take our foot off the gas. That's still got to be our main target. Um, once we've mathematically hit that target, we can then start maybe looking above uh, and looking at different targets. But, you know, we just keep each game as it comes and keep hopefully uh, you know, knocking those points off Brilliant and finally Kevin Druid's at home Tuesday night out for revenge <laughs> Yeah there will be another tough one you know we've got a really tough week with uh, Druid's on Tuesday you know a good young football inside which um, will be tough um, we showed, I think we showed in the last game that we've got more enough to, you know, to cause an upset and, and get some more points on the board and hopefully we will Brilliant Cheers Mike Cheers mate